Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to do that really cool 90s inspired look that you may have seen a lot of celebrities wearing recently. It's that half up, half down, uh, kind of messy bun on the top that you probably wore when you were like 10 years old. Well, it's cool again, but you got to make sure you do it the right way so you don't look super outdated. I like to see this look on straighter hair or wavy or if you do a beach wave or a mermaid wave or something like that. If you have naturally curly hair, I would definitely suggest wearing your hair straight. If you have your hair curly, this look could look super outdated. But I hope you guys enjoy this video and keep watching. Alright guys, so what I'm going to do first is I'm going to part my hair. I'm going to take the hair straight up from behind the ear instead of doing what you would probably typically do and take the hair straight back you're just gonna go straight up and I like to leave a lot of hair left at the bottom and then just put this top portion in a ponytail and then I like to take it in two pieces and then just squeeze it up there. That way you can pull it out a little bit if you want a little bit more volume. And there are a few different ways that you can do the top. If you want it super, super slicked back and sleek, you can do that with putting a little bit of gel on this top portion of hair. You can just hairspray all of that down. You can also part your hair in the middle if you want to leave a couple wispies coming down. That's kind of pretty too. Some people feel like they look really, really young with their hair pulled back. So some people don't like their hair to all be completely pulled back. You can also, before you put it up, back comb this section too if you want to get a little bit more volume. Just so I can get a little bit more volume, I'm just going to pull this section out just a tiny bit. I like it the slicked back sleek look so I'm just gonna kind of go with that today okay and to keep this look looking very trendy and not outdated you definitely want to use a little bit of hair product to keep everything nice and sleek and in place so I'm just gonna take a little bit of this Paul Mitchell hairspray and I'm just gonna make sure that there's no wispies coming out anywhere so I'm just gonna actually spray it on my hands a little bit and rub it together and then I'm just gonna kinda tap everything down because I don't want my hair to look hard and crunchy at all I just want to make sure that there's no wispies flying out anywhere and I'm also gonna spray a little bit in my hands and just kinda get it through the bottom portion too just so that looks very nice and sleek too okay so now that we have all of that in place you can see wearing it just like this would look a little bit outdated. So we're going to do a very trendy bun on top. You can leave it in a pony like this, but if you're going to do that, I would suggest taking a piece of hair and wrapping it around. I think it looks a little more trendy if it's sticking out a little bit more than just flat to the head. But today we're going to do a bun. Okay, so to do that bun, I'm going to first take this ponytail here and I'm going to back comb it. So I'm going to take this little back combing brush and I'm just going to take smaller sections in the ponytail and back comb them. Okay, this is going to get up, give us a lot more body to work with for our bun. So what I'm going to do next is now that that's all messy and gives me a little bit more texture to work with, I'm just going to wrap it around until I get it in a spot where I like it. And then I'm just going to take a couple bobby pins and then pin it in where I want it. a little bit more messy I don't want it to be just perfect because I think it just gives it a fun look so after I get the bun right where I want it then I'm gonna go ahead and take my Paul Mitchell firm style hairspray again and I'm just gonna go through and spray that so it stays right where I want 
Something you can also do is spray your brush with a little bit of hairspray and then go through to make everything nice and slick how you want it. Okay, and here you have it. It's all done. As you can see, this look is super quick and easy to do. At this point, you can go through and put some curls in your hair if you want. I think it's really cute when girls have kind of like a beach wave at the bottom, but I'm just going to leave my hair straight today because I feel like this look make, makes my hair look even longer and I really like that. I hope you guys try this look at home. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and that it was helpful. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.